In this video I will show you how you can make a USB docking station or a USB front panel on your monitor, on your computer screen. You can use any USB hub really. I have this extra USB hub that is type C and I don't really use it much. So the idea here is I want it to be on the screen and I want it to be secured so I don't have to move it around when I install a device on it. I want it to just work. I plug it something in, it, it stays there and I can unplug something. This hub on, uh, on one side, it doesn't have any ports so that's going to be the back of the docking station. And the computer has a front panel but I wanted to have the USB ports close to the screen and my keyboard is pretty old, it has USB 2.0 port so it's pretty slow. The key here is to use mounting tape, any mounting tape really. This is 3M, pretty good mounting tape and it's not permanent, it's better to not to use permanent mounting tape in case you want to remove this later on. And cleaning with alcohol to make sure that there are no dust particles or fingerprints or oil from my hands and it's not ideal here what I'm doing but okay it's not perfection here so just taking a bit of the mounting tape installing it on the back of the USB this is a USB type C hub and the one of the problems with these in general the recent USB type C or USB 3.0 hubs they have a really short cable so for that I use a USB 3.0 extension and an adapter from USB type C to USB 3.0 actually the adapter is from USB type C to USB 3.1 gen 2 or 3 USB 3.2 now how it's called you see I really didn't I messed it up a little bit here but it's okay it's not, no big deal I can always replace this tape if I wanted to later and that label it's pretty weak while I was wiping it I almost removed the whole label maybe I should remove it completely I don't know this is not a great USB hub but it works and there is something interesting about it, I will tell you later on about this. It's something very interesting about Type-C. So, removing the second side of the mounting tape to make it sticky. And now the place where I want to, I mean, you can install this anywhere. Even under your desk you can put the mounting tape. But I chose to put it on this on the old screen. I have two screens here. It's the old screen, classic, and the new screen on the right side. Trying to align it more or less pretty well on the edge there. It doesn't have to be perfect, but it's up to you how well you want it aligned. But okay. Now you see I just turned this screen into a USB Type-C and USB 3.0 hub and I installed the adapter from USB Type-C to USB 3.2 or USB 3.1 Gen 2 and then I connect it to the USB 3.0 cable that's the extension cable and now it doesn't move it doesn't go anywhere the best thing about doing it like this is you can plug in something and you don't have to hold it with the other hand you can plug it in because it's secured to to the desk or to the monitor yeah the usb never get it right the first time i can plug it into any of the ports it shows up I didn't really do a speed test here, actually I did the speed test 10 minutes before recording this video now. Um, there is something interesting about the Type-C port, 
I don't know if this is a problem with my hub or with the adapter or in general about type C. Yeah, you see that's a one free USB 3.0 port on the actual front panel on the computer. So I could move the other one is a hard drive, hard disk. I could move the hard disk to to the in this uh, docking station later. I could even have another one for the hard drives, external hard drives. The interesting thing is, if you plug in the the docking station, this hub into the adapter in one way, it will work with the USB 2.0 speeds. If you notice that your transfer speed is slow, just flip the adapter. It's not this one here. This um, here I'm just trying to see if my phone is connected or charging and I have this cable that is type C to type C and now I can use it easily I can keep it plugged in for my phone so one very important tip here when you connect the USB type C to an adapter to USB 3.0 if it's slow if it has USB 3.0 USB 2.0 speeds just flip the type C connector in the adapter it can go both ways but apparently the full speed is only on one way thanks for watching